What's up everyone, Ryan here, and I'm back with another PGA 2K23 course showcase video. And today we're diving into the new course, Wanamaker Golf Club from the great designer, Maddie from Canada. So Maddie from Canada has created so many incredible golf courses that are so realistic. And here's another one to add to that list. And it's been a long time since I've seen a new course from Maddie, and it's so awesome to see him come back with an incredible golf course excited to showcase this one to you all today as always get on out there in game play this course and let me know how you shoot in a comment down below let's see who can get the best score on the channel here so we're going to be playing this course from the back tees the back tees are the green tees which plays 7386 yards going to be playing pin location number one medium wind speeds all the rest default conditions here for this round of golf Big thank you to Maddie for the hard work designing this incredible golf course. And thank you to you all for all the support here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel across all the content. You all are all legends. If you get some enjoyment, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more and stay tuned for plenty more gaming content, new videos every single day. The one thing about Maddie, when he creates an environment and when he creates a golf course, I can always tell that Maddie not only is his golf knowledge just insane but the way he does his research on the golf environment and golf course he creates and then sets out to design a course that is extremely realistic he does it on another level i don't know if i describe that the the best way but the way he the realism is what i'm going for the way he creates realistic environments realistic golf course the greens the sculpting everything it, it's always exceptional and that's what you're going to notice here so i'm going to go ahead and start this flyover you get to this first tee i mean such a great view it, it's it has that realism effect right it looks like a course you could go out and play now not really a course i could go out and play there's not really that many courses this nice that i have played uh, but we're talking about like a pga tour level golf course that you could see on the tour and this is it from the clubhouse hey you have a nice little tennis club here on the background as well you have the driving range but this whole environment it feels alive right it feels perfectly crafted now it is a coast it's not really a coastal golf course but it is an island plot of land for the views but there are no coastal golf holes you get a glimpse of the coast here when you finish the golf i i believe that's hole number 18th that could be hole number nine but i believe that last hole there to the left of the clubhouse is 18 but you get a glimpse of it but for the most part it's an inland course you have the neighborhood here at the bottom of the course you have kind of the more of the city environment here at the top it's just amazing uh, but let's go. I want to fly over uh, some of the areas because I want to show you the creek. And that creek is most definitely in play. It's not like super risky, but it's sneaky. And I can tell you from personal experience that that, that creek is. That creek may not look like it's in play. But as all creeks, when I play golf courses, they're always in play for me and for whatever reason wherever i play maddie's courses i always tend to find the out of bounds creeks you name it uh, but just look at the houses this and this whole environment it's just fantastic big thank you to maddie for the hard work designing this incredible stuff and i'm gonna go ahead and call it now shot dedications are gonna be i'm not gonna say a word that's not that's not i'm not finishing that sentence i said nothing i said absolutely nothing forge and 58 yard par four to start the day i didn't say a word hopefully i didn't just jinx it right <laughs> you're like well, ryan shot dedications can't be much worse yes they can they, they most definitely can and i think it's cool this week because we saw two totally different types of courses right Earlier in the We're week, I showcased the incredible new fantasy course from B. Brusbury 8 the Star Wars inspired course. If you all have not watched that video or played that course, check it out. But then we go into a very realistic golf course, right? They're complete opposites, but they're both amazing. And it showcase, showcases just 
how diverse the golf courses are in this game and how diverse the creators are. It's amazing. Be the shot. It was perfect tempo. Good swing plane. And that's a good start. Now, one thing I will say, usually Maddie from Canada's shot. courses are extremely challenging. And remember I said this later on, but this footer. course is not as difficult as the last course I played from Maddie. And that's a good thing. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, the last one was good. I can't remember the name of it. Uh, but I remember it was really tough. And this one, although it's tough, it's not it's as difficult. There as the platinum tour Already level courses that i played just one from maddie into this one looking forward to see what you do with and that's a birdie to start the day you'll love to see it yeah that last course crushed me i i can't remember the name of it but it, it crushed me i think i shot over par on it on hole number two and as customary you play a maddie course you have a par three that's aceable you dedicate the par three to maddie Maddie, wherever you are out there on the World Wide Web, this ace is for you. I'm feeling it off the backboard into the hole. Start calling our shots here. Uh, the approach is heading a bit to the right. Well, missed the green well, there on that one. I don't have much to say about that. <laughs> but, but what I do have to say about it is let's just birdie this and be on our way. For Maddie! For Maddie! Well, that's a nice chip. Well done. It was a nice and chip, as John said. To save par. You know what they say about par dedications? Sometimes they're just as sweet as birdies. I don't know who says that, but I'm and sure some people go. did, and that's two points that, to Maddie. I believe it was right Maddie who one. said that. Yeah. I think Maddie said that on the last course I played. <laughs> We've got a long believe, yeah, Maddie said that. Down on this one. Okay, 432 yard par four here, hole number two. Just a beautiful, awful, the sculpting. The framing, the planting, it's just superb. <laughs> yeah, I tried to do that. See, superb. Uh, Maddie gets a bonus points there for that from bounce. Here, it's about 115 what? yards to the pin. Yeah, 114 yards uphill 11. While we got lucky, we hopefully wouldn't use up all of our luck. But what in the world just happened? Ah! I will say, Tempo's on today. And I know I'm not supposed to say that. I'm supposed to not talk about Tempo We're when it's on, on but it's on. Like, that one. Well done. That's th two perfect Tempos already in three holes. 16 feet, uphill three inches, steady left to right. You can make this. One's on a Get good in. Line. Just broke too much at the end. Maybe if you hit that a bit hit harder, it might have dropped. Power into that putt. Ryan's good. used to using the force this week All on the right, Star Wars course. The force isn't working here on this golf course. Not sure why. Okay, one under par on your round. And here we it's have a lovely par four hole. Amazing. These these views are spectacular. Like the natural sculpting in planting it's amazing and we have a 378 yard par four very short hole but you can see danger everywhere but i'm just gonna hit it in the fairway let's not complicate things tempo is on like we're either on perfect or light fast that was a trap yeah that's a trap mm -hmm. don't don't okay. go for that Here's your second cool shot design though. Four. Short par four, but it's it's not not just a walk in the park out there. 92 yards, uphill 14. We have an 81 to 93 percent bunker lie. I'm gonna do sand wedge, take a little bit off, land it off that slope. It's 
So under swung a little bit and that uphill lie really affected that distance. Still got a good bounce though. Stay on the green. Stay on the green. Yes. Good shot. When you talk to this course, it you listens. Two under with this putt. I've right learned here. that. Course is alive. 17 footer, steady left to right. Make this. Well, it's heading towards the Interesting hole. swing plane. Even with that swing plane, even with the big pull, that means we misread that a putt too much pace on that by one. a couple. And here we go. Par putt coming up. This putt's going. We made the putt, though. We'll nice take it. Done. Not going to complain about a par. One under through four is pretty good. I was expected to be a bit lower, though, because honestly, those are the and scorable holes on this golf course. Par. And this course starts to pick up a little bit more in difficulty. Right. Look at the way, so with the way this is sculpted here, you see how everything is funneling down either into the rough or into that bunker. But if you send it off this left rough or fairway, you might hit the fairway. Love that design and you get a great view of the neighborhood and houses to your left, the city in the background. You know, the background kind of looks like a university as well. That's one thing like when I see that, I think of a university. They could just be business buildings. There in the city but it kind of looks like a like a university over there dorm rooms there or well, those could just be apartments but maybe this is a university i don't know just hit the ball maddie can you kick this one in the fairway wherever you are out there That's no good. Can't say you didn't try. Shot on good the news pitch. is there's a lot of light rough on this golf course. A bad news is you better not be going in this bunker. Trust me. <laughs> From personal experience, you're not hit it right there. So what I'm going to do to not do that, I'm going to hit a four hybrid. You know, the four bunker is tough too, but I think we can hit from there. I'm going to do a lofted shot land right over this bunker and maybe have a chance to make it this is the best tempo has been in a while we are dialed in look at this oh don't you dare All right, Maddie Ryan Gamer would like to have a meeting in the clubhouse after this round of golf and talk about that like. one. <laughs> Let's just splash this one in for Eagle. 79 to 91% lie. Sent it. Uh, not a bad shot, though. But wow. Good job out of the sand. Well done. We struck that hybrid really good. The problem is we're now in the light rough. Couldn't generate as much spin. And these are fast greens. 164 green speeds. That I didn't mess Good. around. That's a birdie, though. Oh, yeah. That was fantastic. Get your coffee, whatever you're drinking. Cheers, everybody. Look Not at that Ryan waving down. to all his fans out here on the course. He's waving at Maddie. He knows Number Maddie's six. out there in the clubhouse. He's like, I want to have a talk with you after this round. So, hoping for a five-star meal as well. Do they have those at the clubhouse here? 482 yards, tough fairway to hit, but to be fair, all fairways are tough to hit for me. So why not try? Come on, bounce right, kick it into the fairway, come on, kick it, kick it, kick it. Well, that'll, that'll happen. That was just... Playing games with our heart, you know, it, our second shot it looked like it was going to roll all the way and then it just stops. Almost got a great bounce. Now, with the way this is sculpted, we have four, 149 left, uphill 12. So it's going to play about 153. I like the 8 iron here. Off that, I kind of want the wind to blow this into that left side hill and roll it down. In. Ooh, look at the lie though. 89, 91% is not ideal. I'm going to do a slide over power. Heading left. 
Well, that, that was a swing plan. At least tempo was good. That's unfortunate. Well, that's too bad. Uh, pretty sure you weren't planning on that. That's okay. John, how do you know we weren't planning on this? It could be a highlight real shot. 13-yard birdie chip. Full loft and backspin. Got to make sure we don't put this chip on that red or orange slope. We've got to put it down a little bit further. Maybe not that far. Oh, it's fine. The, yeah, because if you hit that short, it's going to pick okay. up so much speed down that hill. That's where you don't want to be. So far, so good. That's Not bad. Do just nicely. Way better than how I played on Maddie's. The last course Still I played for Maddie. Under and I feel like it's been a hour. long time. I can't even remember the last time. I feel like it's been like six months or longer. Am I wrong on that? Send this in. That's half par three, but a beautiful view. It's got to make its way from right to left, and it should. Question is how much? Come on, ball. Keep going. Keep going. Go all the way. That had the line. That's great sculpting from Maddie on that one. Left to the hole. Okay, 12 feet, downhill 2 inches. It's it's a little bit left to right, but not much. Got to make this. No, oh, it's getting there. Let's go, birdie. And that's your birdie. Come on. What, do we have a par dedication so far to Matty? Is that right? Is there just one whole dedication Currently, so far? Three under par for I the lost day. count. <laughs> Even though I think I've just power, done one. Wind on this hole. Not like it's hard to count when you're at one, but... You know, you know what they say about numbers. What a beautiful view. Just fantastic. Definitely taking a screenshot there. Beautiful from the sculpting, the way the bunkers are sculpted. Just the framing of the entire golf hole. Amazing. Let's send this into the hole. How about it? 383 yards. <laughs> We're not sending that into the hole. Maybe if Ryan turned in the hook, he might. Brush a 500-yard drive. To be fair, we wouldn't need a 500-yard drive in this hole, but nice. still. This one's about 105 yards out. So the green, it's working its way from right to left. And... We can send this into a little bit of wind. Attack. Again, tempo is spot yeah, on today. Go either way. So, I hit the range for a little bit before this. And I can tell you, my tempo was terrible. But I did hit a perfect to close out the range. And I just left. I hit that perfect, I'm like, okay, I'm ready. And clearly, I, I was. Okay, we got a nice little... Left to right, easy break. About a cup and a half outside to the left, probably. It's got to get the speed right, though. Well, the putt appears to be online. And that'll do. Nice birdie. Putt. I like the way this is shaping up. That's your second in a row of birdies. We're coming for the course record here. What a golf course, though. This is fantastic. After that hole. We close out with the 519-yard par 4. Can we sit it over this bunker? Maddie would never trick us. Well, he would. Go oh, right. Looks like a fairway off the tee here. John called fairway. That makes me nervous, even though it looks like it is. But when John calls fairway, it never works out. John! <laughs> well, I thought that was going to end up uh, better than it did here in the room. Maddie? Right. We blame Setting John or Maddie? First cut of rough. Good drive, though. Hey, at least we're in the light rough. This could be heavy rough. Could be a lot worse. 88 to 92% lie with the way the green is sculpted. This is a golfer sculpted dream. Yeah, go I meant to say golfer sculpted green. It could be a golfer sculpting dream. I can't say I've ever dreamed about 
the sculpting of greens, but you know, maybe some designers out there do. Bounce right, come on. Be the one. He's gonna come back. He's gonna come back, come back, come back. Well, or unfortunately, not. we missed the green here. This one's your third. Good news is we can chip this over that first initial slope, full off the backspin to get it to catch. This might go in. <laughs> that was certainly an interesting swing. Wow. Nice chip. Fantastic. Was it, and John? Got this left for par I guess it was a one. fantastic result, but not good All execution. Right. Solid putt. But that's the right thing now, in this game. Four under chip shots are day. so forgiving, right? So you can fast them and pull them a mile, and you're just you can not going to be penalized too much. This hole, left to right. Shooting back towards the neighborhood here. We got the water tower. What a view. And this is my type of golf hole. Short par four. Not a lot of danger. And hopefully this one's nice and safe in the fairway. Yeah, I tried to do that. I definitely was aiming for a short swing before the bunker bounce over. I wasn't trying to carry oh, that bunker and stop it. Now, this is tough. Wow, we have 54 yards left. That was a trap for Maddie. Maybe not an intentional trap, but I think the shot of this golfo is actually back in this area for an easy lob. If you move up into this range, it's a partial pitch or some type of difficult flop shot. Yeah, this is tough. You know what? I'm going to flop this. No, it's uphill lie. That's not ideal. The only other option, not the only other option, the other smart option is a partial pitch, which is a very difficult shot, but I'm going to try it. Don't try this at home. Hit a better shot than I did off the tee. See, and that's, that's what you can get yourself into into this position we kind of got lucky though a lot of times that would roll down here we're on the green side rough it's actually a great spot to chip from great spot to chip from that ball was going in and it just decided to with the chip. go the opposite way that was heartbreaking let's, let's save power on this one. i just love how alive this environment is like it, it feels like I don't, I don't, it just feels like a golf course on kind of a, at a university with neighborhood, you know? This <laughs> That's so a far. terrible description, but you, it just feels Nicely real. Done. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. It feels like a real environment. Pretty amazing. That's going to keep you at four under after that hole. We got a right to left cross breeze going on this hole. This is, this is the golf hole. Well, where I might have found the creek before. It is off there to the green to the left, and you don't think it's in play. You think, yeah, no way I'm going to hit the creek. And then you very fast it and pull it, and that ball bounces heavily like that. down that slope. <laughs> second shot on right there. Number 11. Now, this green is very difficult. The course does start to pick up difficulty. I'm going to go loft and spin and send this out to the right. Yeah, this is a tough call. Not so sure I hit a pitch shot because I thought it less like to go in the water. Thank you. Well, missed the green on that one, but uh, I've already forgotten about it. Thanks, John, this for already forgetting shot. about it. The reason I hit the pitch there, the last time I hit a normal and I, fa I, I fasted it, and sit that ball straight into the creek. Even call that a creek. What is that? It's a creek, right? What a shot! Come on! Okay, positive thoughts. Let's save par. Short sided right flop shot. Very difficult shot to hit. Love that. Nicely played. Let's miss that. Did, did I pull it? I might have pulled it. That thing went off almost out to the left. Ryan pulled that so much and the ball broke left on a left to right five. hill. Okay, are you all thinking what I'm thinking? 
I know Maddie's thinking what I'm thinking. Or showcase Ace, everybody. Are you ready for the show? Imagine. If you're if you're new here, yeah, we we get course showcase aces all the time. Just make sure you don't go back and watch my other course showcase videos. If you're not new here, don't say anything. And Maddie, this one's for you. 128 yards, downhill 17, lovely par three. Gonna go normal gap wedge partial, slight backspin, land it short right over that bunker, and hold it out. Over, over swing, still might come back. Yeah, I tried to do that. <laughs> Definitely wasn't trying to lend it right over that bunker. Just trying to for the back oh, yeah. slope. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll approve that. You'll go wasn't to bad though. Round, if you think this. As far as shot dedications go, that's up there at the elite level for me. Right to left, not a whole lot of movement. I, it definitely breaks more at the end. Great work. Swing so plane was perfect. <laughs> Nobody watched that back. A definitely a calculated pull. I knew I had overread the break, so I knew I had to pull it by a mile. And okay, I'm sticking to that story. Currently. Here we go. Par five ahead of us. Let's see. Okay, what happens. 596 yard par five here. Can we bounce off the road? The road is out of bounds, though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, I don't think that Maddie had planned for anybody to go for the 600 yard drive. I'm going to try to overpower this. I, I just glanced over the fact that that was a dedicated birdie on a long putt for Maddie. Maddie, that one is for you. I almost, I was so surprised that that was a shot dedication. I completely forgot. <laughs> That's, uh, what are we up to? Five points, a par and a birdie? Wow. I, I was I, I was like never expecting it that I just completely glance over the fact that we just made that putt. I'm sitting here telling live stories about how I tried to pull it into the hole. All right, here's our second shot. On that was 13. a dedicated birdie for probably the first time ever for Maddie. 257 yards uphill four. I'm gonna go three wood loft and backspin, and. This could be an Albi. Tin the flag. So I will say, Tempo's been great today. Swing plane has had its moments. Most of those moments have not been good, but it's had its moments. Look at you go. On the green and under regulation. Putting for Eagle here. Good stuff. But, I mean, if swing plane was on this round, it would have been a very boring round, right? Because tempo's been great. If swing plane was great, you all would have just seen dart after dart. That, that wouldn't have been as exciting. Actually, that would be pretty exciting. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I, I want to throw darts every single time, so. Never done it? Oh. It just never broke at the end. I, I crushed it, though. Wow, that's a fast putt. Maddie got us on that one. Good luck here. We've got 15 feet. You don't expect an easy eagle putt, though, but we're left with a tester here for birdie. 15 feet? About a cup and a half outside to the right is what it looks like to me. Maybe a little bit more. It's getting there. Maybe a little oh. bit more indeed. All right, par putt. Not bad though. Pretty you want to birdie that simple hole. You're still right there at five under par after that. Well, one. simple hole if you don't send it out of bounds to the right, which is easy to do. You slow it off the tee, you get okay, carried away. Par four for this one. It's out of bounds. What an amazing golf course though. This is fantastic. 521 yard par four. It looks like that bunker is there out to get us too. If, we, if if swing plane was there this round, we may have shot 15 under. Just the, the tempo has been some of the best tempo I've ever had in the game. Well done. 
Okay, about 215 yards or so. 214 into a slight headwind. I'm going to go three hybrid, keep it under the wind a bit, send it off that slope, and I hope that it stops. This might end up in some rough. John's right. Yeah, it's just, it bounced dead straight. No, I'm glad okay. it's not in the that's bunker, okay. though. We'll get on the green, maybe on the next shot. I'm going to do full loft okay, and ba backspin here. One. We're in the rough. And going to take this one. I'm going to try to land it close to the hole and then get it to stop. That thing hit pretty firm. It. I was trying to land it further than that. Liking that one. Nice chip. Good shot, though. Okay, that putt's done. Okay. Five, Five unders. I, I'm really one. happy with. I mean, th this course... It's way more scorable than okay, Ma Maddie usual Maddie courses, and it's not easy though. It, it's definitely not easy. You can get yourself into trouble, but it's a very scorable course if you if you really capitalize on strategy, hit some good shots. And that was. I don't think I've ever been this locked in off the tee. I I wouldn't be surprised if. We've hit 90% of fairways. Right? I mean, we haven't missed yeah. very many at good all. With your Maybe I'm just remembering the good shots. <laughs> Have we missed a fairway? I Last time I said that, I think we had 50% fairways. But I really feel like today's been a great day. Off the tee. Some of you are laughing right now. <laughs> I don't know. I, I feel good about the driving, actually. I wouldn't be surprised if it's like 85, 90. Remember, I said this, but I feel like I've been dialed in. Watch. If it's 50 again, I may retire. If we get there and it's like 50%, this may be the last course showcase video on the channel. Okay, Hope you all enjoyed the... <laughs> Hope and you all enjoyed the content long putt to here on the Gamer Builder YouTube channel. But if we get up there and it says 50, oh, Ride Gamer may, may retire. I crushed that putt. That's, that's tough. Foot putt here. How many putts in a row have we just sent? Puff par putt right to left. Going towards that yes, hole. I hit that one firm. That's the and line the I was going drops. for. There's your par. So we have one shot dedication left. We could possibly do a bonus eyes closed on the par 5 18th. Five under still after that hole. This, this design is phenomenal. The 16th. It's amazing. From start to finish, this course has been fantastic. Very well designed. Every single hole sculpting amazing, planting, natural sculpting, natural planting. So well designed. And how about an ace? Maddie, this one's for you. We're going to do a bonus eyes close on the 18th. You better believe it. Ooh, can we get a bounce to the right, please? Well, it's a gur. <laughs> that gur's for you, Maddie. And this is a great opportunity for a highlight real birdie. We already have a par and two and a birdie so far. Five points. That's safe. To the designer. This putt is for birdie. We get to eight. A 45 footer. Nice left to right off this slope. One time, everybody. For Maddie. Not bad. Six foot putt. Hold that thought. This putt's tracking. Not bad. Another par. And that's your par. So, seven points on the showcase. But the good news is, we still have a potential for an albatross. Bonus eyes close. So, as customary, if you're new here on my course showcase videos, Five I dedicate for the moment. three shots to the designer. Teeing up now I can also do a 17. bonus one. But it has to be eyes closed on every shot. So, I can... Do pre-shot setup with eyes open, of course. See a gap there, right? <laughs> Ryan, what? 
You all see that gap I'm talking about? I may be making it up, but I feel like I see a gap right between that bottom tree. No, there's no way. As much as I want to. I, I feel like there is a shot there. But I, I feel like we would just <laughs> hit that tree and it would come back and knock Ryan out. He would have to retire anyways. I'm going to go ahead and predict around 155 yards out. 90, no, 85 fairway percentage. I would be surprised if it's any lower than that. We've been dialed in off the tee. 154 into a wind. You know, I find myself so focused on tempo that I miss swing playing. And do you all, does anybody else out there struggle to, to when you, you can master one of them in a round, but you can't get the other one? So for me, I have to focus really hard to get swing playing. And then when I focus really hard to get swing playing, I miss tempo. So then if I want to hone in on tempo, I really focus on tempo and I miss swing playing. But that's honestly, to me, the beauty of this video game. It's it's how challenging it is. But we're left with a downhill one foot on 164 green speeds. we got to be careful. <laughs> that, <laughs> that ball broke like five different ways. Get a par. What in the world? This putt's going. Good read, though. Good stroke in the hole for a par. Are you all thinking what I'm thinking? We're having a great round. This is a bogey-free round. We have a par five left. Let's see if it's albatrossable and first. five under still for you after that hole. Well, Heads all... Up. Wind's going right to left on this one. You all better hope for the fairway because the bonus eyes closed dedication only happens if we hit the fairway here. But with the percentage that we're having today, we're hitting this fairway. One's heading to the fairway, I think. Don, don't say that. Yes! All right, good luck with your second shot here on the 18th Okay. Hole. Maddie and everyone else out there on YouTube, you better hold on to your seat. It's about to be electric. Are you all ready for this? Maddie, wherever you are out there on the World Wide Web, a fantastic golf course from start to finish. Sculpting superb, planting, routing, everything. Absolutely perfect. And you know what's even, what's also perfect? A albatross, bonus eyes closed dedication. All right, let's get dialed in. It's gonna be a little bit right to left. Look at that beautiful clubhouse. Ryan, we'll be having a meeting with Maddie after that green earlier, after that hybrid shot, so. I think we have the line, a little bit of backspin. All right, Maddie, this one's for you, buddy. Close the eyes, get locked in. It's another day at the office, right? Oh, good. Sounded good. I think that hit green. It sounded like it. I hear the flag. I don't hear John saying a word. John? There you go. This is this is shaping up. Putting for eagle next. Yes! Yeah, if you sink this, Come on, what a long shot. I keep waiting for John to say something. He left me hanging there. <laughs> just had my eyes closed, just waiting. Ow. That one's for you, Maddie. This is not what I was hoping for. A 66 foot putt. Let me guess, it rolled up that slope and they just kept slowly rolling back down. Alright. Dedicated eagle chance. 
Hope you all were holding on to your seat for that one. <laughs> Told you all to hold on. About to get electric. All right, Maddie, this eagle's for you, buddy. Thanks for the hard work. Least we can do is dedicate an eagle. John? Where is it, John? Just a little too much power. Here we go. A little? <laughs> okay. I see, so believe it or not, when you close your eyes during the golf shot, it's tough to get the power of the shot right. Because, I mean, you all know why. You can't see the club. So you just kind of, it's kind of a mystery out there. And clearly, Ryan got a little carried away on that one. 24 downhill two inches for a dedicated birdie. We should have stopped while we were ahead. Eight points dedicated, right? I think that's right. This one's for you, Maddie. Oh man, that would have been something. To oh man, is not what I want to hear. Oh yeah, my! Here. Did that lip out? It's gonna be interesting going back to watch that. But pars. Some designers say pars are just as. Good, dedicated as birdies because it shows difficulty of the golf hole. It shows the beauty of the design. I just made that up, but I'm I'm pretty sure there's a designer out there who thinks that. So let's <laughs> let's say that Maddie is that designer. This par is for you, Maddie. And time seemed to fly by, didn't it? Uh, just like that, the putt drops and your round is over. What a course! That was fantastic. Wow. That is an easy favorite. That is an easy five star. There's a reason that car is rated that there's a reason that course is rated five star. It's already rated five star at the bottom right. And the reason for that is because that is golf design perfection. And I am very surprised to see 71% there. Huh. Not for sure it'd be in the 80s. I feel like I was dialed in off the tee. What do I know? 71 fairways and 66 greens. Oh my, I know some of you are already shaking your head like Ryan. No, you didn't hit it. 71 is pretty good though, I have to say. That's well above my average of 60. Now green's not ideal. Not ideal at all. And 1.5 putts per hole. We shot a five under. That course, I feel like is a tell of two nines. The front nine is much more scorable. You get to that back nine, it's terrifying. Those greens are tough. It's a lot more tactical on the back. That is genius golf design, though. That That is amazing. Wow. Very nicely done, Maddie. you legend. Thanks for all the hard work designing this incredible golf course. Get on out there and dominate on this golf course, YouTube. I feel like you all are going to break records on this course. You know, I, I feel like there's a potential to shoot 15 under here. If you use good strategy... You hit fairways, you hit greens, you're going to score. But one thing that I found out is those greens are tough. And if you don't hit your spots, you're going to miss the green and leave yourself a difficult chip shot. So that that's just genius golf design right there from Maddie. Thank you for the hard work and thank you everybody for watching this video to the end. If you got some enjoyment, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more. And I have plenty of other PGA 2K23 and other gaming videos here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. You see new videos every single day. Uh, some golf, some baseball, some hockey, some a little bit of everything. Really all types of sports here. And even more on my second channel, Gamer Ability 2. Link in the description to that. I will see you all in the next video. As always, have a fantastic day, everybody.